Hi everyone, I'm Ramona and I'm going to be doing a quick book review. It's my first one, so bear with me. Um, the book that I read was um, The Left-Handed Booksellers of London and it is by Garth Nix. It's a fantasy fiction novel and it takes place in 1983. And it's a sort of like reality, like a different like fantasy kind of universe that's blended in with um, like actual London and um, I honestly think it was one of my favorite books I've ever read. Uh, the main character Susan I thought she was really cool and she's kind of goes to London on this like journey to figure out who she is and who her father is and it becomes this mystery and sort of unexplicable events happen and you really go along um, with her to figure out what's going on and all sorts of things like that. Also, main character is Merlin. He is also super cool in my opinion. Um, you kind of, he's like a likable, like little, like, I don't even know. He just like adds like such a, I, I can't even describe it, but just I like his character a lot. And his sister Vivian also goes on a journey with Susan throughout the book. Um, I thought it was really cool because of the use of libraries or bookshops, I'm sorry because um, it's like they're the booksellers and um, you'll find out more about that. I don't want to spoil it, but it's, I think I would recommend it to anyone who's looking for a good fantasy kind of mystery action sort of book like that. It wasn't uh, too long of a read, only about 400 pages and I thought it was really fun to get through. I'm hoping for a sequel because um, I honestly just loved the book so much and the only thing is it was published um let's see sorry 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 well it was published in 2020 so we're probably gonna have to wait a while for that but um i'm really looking forward to it garth nix also wrote sabriel um which i think i'm gonna look into because this book was just really good i can't stress that enough um but yeah i also I can read the inside really quick. If you don't want that, then it's okay. Just here it is. Um, in a slightly alternate London in 1983, Susan Arkshaw is looking for her father, a man she has never met. Crime boss Frank Thringley might be able to help her, but Susan doesn't get time to ask Frank any questions before he is turned to dust by the prick of a silver hat pin in the hands of the outrageously attractive Merlin. Merlin is a young left-handed bookseller, one of the fighting ones, with the right-handed booksellers, the intellectual ones. He belongs to an extended family of magical beings who police the mythical and legendary old world when it intrudes on the modern world, in addition to running several bookshops. And yes, that's about it. I really suggest that you read The Left-Handed Booksellers of London. Check it out at the library, and I hope you all have a great day. Thank you!